Well, I'm on the farm today, and uh, today is December the 23rd, and I thought I'd give you a hay update. Things are kind of things are kind of quiet here on the farm. Yesterday, we had a busy day uh, selling a little bit of hay, and uh, so I moved out some more of this uh, second cutting uh, cow and goat hay. Uh, this is really all we got left of it, uh, right in here. I left a gap between my second cutting, although this looks kind of brown. It's actually some really nice second cutting hay, same as what's over on that stack over there. And uh, and then underneath all that is some first cutting hay, uh, which I'll get to here in just a bit. But uh, I won't say sales have been brisk, but uh, uh, they have ticked up a little bit. So coming in here from the side door of my barn, uh, probably the biggest thing is uh, we've moved out our uh, round bales. We've got a couple of them kind of stuffed in the uh, the stack right there and then a kind of a smaller one right here. But I uh, had one customer that, that was able to get uh, all of those on his on his trailer and uh, what you're seeing here this kind of disorganized looking hay right in here is just where we had to move some bottom bales out to be able to get the massive 50 in here with the loader and then some of them some of the hay you can see up there it's kind of tumbled uh, where we stacked in behind these round bales and it fell down in here and we just kind of moved some of that stuff uh, over there but uh Somewhere underneath all this, there's actually a uh, second cutting. Uh, I'm sorry, first cutting square bales. This is all, this is all second cut, and it's some nice stuff. So over here on this side, you can kind of see. Gosh, it's, the sun is really kind of makes it hard to to do a video here but believe it or not from there up is second cutting and there's actually a color difference I don't know if you can see that or not but uh, this first cutting is down below and uh, got a fair amount of that but again and then this is first cutting back over in here and uh, we haven't really made available our first cutting uh, hardly at all because uh the way this stuff was this second cutting was stacked on top of it i didn't want to have a la an avalanche of hay uh coming this way but uh probably about ready to start letting it uh sell and i've got some people interested in some of these bottom bales here over on the other side but uh the thing about it is uh the 22nd was the first day uh, we start getting a little more daylight every day, and uh, so, you know, we're kind of anxious to get the uh, balers uh, tuned up and a little of field maintenance going. I'll have a video uh, with our plans later on in uh, 2024. Can you believe it's going to be 2024 here soon? Hay sales are ticking up a little bit. Uh, Pretty happy with that. Uh, definitely going to have some carryover into the new year, which is actually something I want. So just a short uh, hay update video. Uh, we are selling a little bit of hay. Our round bales are essentially going. And um, I was kind of surprised how quickly I put those up for sale and they, and, uh, they, they got snatched up. Um, but anxious for uh january february to get in here and get out and let's see things turn green in march and april and uh look forward uh to our 2024 20, hay season so uh, got the john deere 5055 over there and 335 John Deere round baler 348 back over there the farm all 350 and out on that side is the model 50 with the loader 
and uh, hope everybody has a Merry Christmas, and we'll talk to you later.